Can you explain why using an RX preset in the preset tabs makes a noticeable difference in flight performance? Yeah, so the um, uh, the RC link is sending packets at a certain rate, right? RC packets. Every time there's an RC packet comes in, the RC channels get updated inside Betaflight. And what that means is that the RC, the, the, you actually call, it's called RC command. RC command is a stepwise function, not a smooth function. So every time a packet comes in, the RC channels get updated, right? And so that causes stair stepping, whether it's once every, it's 50 times a second or 500 times a second, the stair stepping happens. Beta flight then, the problem is that beta flight has a PID, uh, PID term called feed forward and feed forward triggers off of changes in the RC command. So when that stair stepping happens, feed forward does nothing, nothing, nothing. Ah, feed forward, big jump. Every time the stair stepping happens, feed forward freaks out. So what they do is before feed forward gets applied, they smooth it. They have a low pass on it to smooth it out. And that makes everything better. If the feed forward is not tuned correctly and the low pass filtering is not tuned correctly for the packet rate, then the PID loop can freak out and the quad can fly badly. So when you have a fast packet rate with not enough smoothing, feed forward freaks out. And so that's why when you, when you have a faster packet rate, you need to, uh, you need to tweak the load, the correct preset. That's what the preset does. The preset changes the feed forward settings and it changes the low pass settings, the filtering settings. You just, the long story short is load the preset that most closely matches your packet rate. 